Hello guys, this is Chetan Verma and you are watching my YouTube channel CSP Institute. So today's video is about literal in Python. A literal is a constant value that is stored into a variable in a program. Observe the following statement a equal to 15. Okay. Here a is the variable into which the constant value 15 is stored. Hence the value 15 is called literal. This particular 15 is called literal since 15 indicates integer value it is called the integer literal it is called the integer literal okay the following are different types of literals in python first one is numeric literal another one is boolean literal And then we have string literal. So let's talk one by one regarding all of this. Okay. So first one is numeric literal. So let's talk about numeric literal. First one is numeric literal. These literal represents number. Please observe the different types of numeric literals available in Python. First one is uh, a is 45 and 15 these are the integer literal these are the integer literal then we have 3.145 0.4 these are the float literal okay then we have 0 x 5 a 1 c we know this is hexadecimal hexadecimal literal uh, literal then we have 0 5 5 7 this is octal literal octal literal then we have 0 b 1 1 1 0 1 0 1 this is binary literal okay and at last 18 plus 3 j okay this is complex literal so i hope you have understood about numeric literal so this is already we have covered in our previous videos so now i'm just giving you the brief uh, intro uh, brief about uh, all we have covered so far <clears throat> second one is we have boolean literal so boolean literal is very simple boolean literals are the true and false uh, false values is stored inside uh, into a boolean type variable suppose a equals to true so this is boolean literal or false it can be a equals to false also so t and f should be capital keep this thing in your mind then we have a string literal third we have a string literal this is very important guys so string literal a group of characters in a, uh, is called a string literal. These string literals are enclosed in a single quote as I told you in, our, in my last video also or double quote also. It can be enclosed in single or double quotes. Okay. Or triple quotes. 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. Single for single quote, double quote or triple quote. Okay. In Python, there is no difference between single quotes, quoted uh, string or and double quoted string. Single or double quoted string should end in the same line as suppose S1 equal to this is my YouTube channel. Okay. So it should be end in a uh, single or double quote should be end in same line. Another one is I am Chetan Varma. This is double quoted string. Okay. So there is no difference between single quoted and double quoted. These both should be uh, end in the same line. Okay. But if you are talking about triple. So for this if you if i'm talking about triple quote suppose s1 is this is this is india's 
इंडियाज फर्स्ट फर्स्ट पाइथन पाइथन वीडियो सॉरी गाइस दिस इज नॉट बट एज एन एग्जांपल आई एम टेकिंग सो हियर यू कैन सी आई इंक्लूडेड ट्रिपल कोड I have covered this part also in my previous video. Uh, you can check it out. But again, I'm telling you regarding this. As to triple quote again, I am Chetan. I am an student. I am a student. Three. So multiple uh, uh, line string. when a uh, sing string uh, literal extended beyond a single line we should go for a triple quoted uh, quotes as as you can see here in the preceding examples the uh, strings have taken up to three lines uh, one two three lines uh, suppose i have given one more line inside there or two lines here we have given only two lines so hence we inserted Uh, then inside uh, triple single quotes or uh, single quotes also we can do so suppose this is single quoted and double triple quotes inside double triple quotes also i can do so okay so i have covered already in my previous video so if you want to check it out you can check there also so as like this there are something inside the st string only some important escape characters in string i just want to tell you we can use escape uh, characters like slash and inside a uh, string literal for example string equals to this is slash n backslash n python and when you will print it so this is next line uh, if i will print it print string so what will happen this is will be in one line and python will be in another line so these this is called escape characters so let's talk different kind of escape characters important escape characters so very first we have backslash backslash is used for new line new line continuation continuation okay another we have double backslash so display a single this display display a single slash it will display a single slash and then we have the backslash or single quote display a single quote it will display a single quote then we have backslash double quote so it will display you display a double quote okay then we have backslash b so it will give you back space okay then backslash r it will give you enter okay then backslash t it will give you horizontal horizontal tab space and we have another twos are there sorry and so we have one more v this is called what sorry backslash v vertical space vertical tab tab space then we have n equals to new line so check it out do some fast uh, programming in that then you will understand string string dot by okay so here str equal to this is chetan simple then print this print not str s equals to okay 
what I done? String dot by. Is there any problem? No. Let's do here only. Sorry, this. Ah. Uh, print s here and then we have another uh, s equal to now use different types of things this is this is shetan varma so here provide one more thing yes it is showing a kind of error here it is the error uh, flaws all it is showing a different kind of errors here let me shut it out let me make one more file here uh, basic basics of python basic dot by okay so here we'll do s equal to chetan and uh, backslash if i'll give you so backslash this is this is my youtube channel youtube channel okay then one more as s1 will print s1 equal to double backslash so this this is then double backslash cheta okay then s2 equal to this is backslash a single quote single quote and cheta and s3 equal to this is this is a uh, backslash double quote uh, chetan okay then s4 equal to this is backslash p chetan s5 equal to this this is backslash r chetan and s6 equal to this is backslash t chetan then s7 equal to this is backslash v chetan s8 equal to this is backslash n chetan okay now print it print all of this print as v v v now one two three because I want to print different strings uh, 5, 6, 7, 8. Okay, control plus S on the terminal and here basic dot pi open basic basic dot pi. So here you can see that. In our program, we very first we have provided Chetan 
this is uh, my youtube channel so there is no change simply it has returned then we have this is uh, dub double black slash so what will happen it will uh, print single uh, single the slash okay backslash and black back um, backslash uh, single quote it returns single quote they are double quote uh, for uh, s4 is uh, uh, sing backslash b it provides us backspace so here you can check backspace is uh, written here and in our next line uh, next line s5 this is the uh, this is uh, backslash r this is for enter so enter you can see enter means next line so only chetan is rep uh, represented here so then let me do something for you okay this is for s1 s2 s3 so we'll show you different distinguish between all these things s1 equal to this you can easily distinguish s3 here s4 s5 s6 s7 s8 control plus s open new terminal so here you can check so s1 is this is chetan uh, so with the uh, with this only this is chetan so this is our s1 and sorry this is chetan with uh, with this this is s2 s3 s4 and s5 is here uh, because of enter it it is showing chetan only and then we have uh, s6 okay s6 we have chetan uh, is uh, backslash t chetan so you here you can do these number of things and you can find the different difference between all of these okay i hope you have understood till here if you have any doubt regarding this you do comment okay have a good day